All right, I'm on a little bit of an angle, and I'm actually not even looking that way. I realized I could turn my screen and then put it back in, so the screen is... So basically, my fold-out screen is back in place, but it's you can fold it back in with the screen out, which is pretty cool, so I'm not even looking that way. Joel, you'll remember this. It's one of the first zooms I did when I was here. I got a different angle on it, and I think there was Bigfoots on this thing, so that's why I'm, I'm just taking this zoom one more time. It's just a white rock. Hold on. I can't get the exact because I'm not moving. I see brown there. It's this crazy st stick, it just sticks out like a sore thumb white rock. There's no other rock on the, in this entire region that looks like that. And last time I zoomed, we, we all agree that we seem to see movement or something going on there. Now, I'm not expecting that to be the same exact case this time, but I did want to get a zoom. I'm doing this without looking, that's why it's kind of weird. There we go. So whatever way I want to move, it's going to be the opposite. I'm not, if I go down, yeah, right there. I've been doing all my stuff on the other side of that hill. But as you can see, I mean, it just doesn't end here, you guys. There's so many places. It, it doesn't look like much until you're standing up there and you realize how incredibly, amazingly hidden and everything is. I just love it. I'm actually just driving around right now. I'm done filming for the day, unless I see something crazy. Give me a second. Just a real quick clip, you guys. I just wanted to hear me pull over a second. I just want you guys to see just how beautiful this place is. Look at this. Now keep in mind, it's extremely deceiving how big that is. You could never see a person, you know, from here. It's 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 uh, extremely deceiving. I'll look at the video and be like, you know, these guys just don't aren't gonna understand what it's like. The video doesn't give you the size. It's it's pretty crazy. But anyway, look at this. So this is this new, this new area. I found it took me hours, but back way back there, you'll see there's pine trees. I don't know if I can even zoom on them, but back there is really difficult, and I can't get against there either. But uh, I, I just find it really, really, really incredible over there. I don't even know what I think is incredible. I think it's just the sheer beauty of what's over there. And and typically with these guys, especially with what's going on here, you, you just know, you know, um, you know. I have all these other spots too. I'm 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 looking in here. This is where I am. It shows you how small it looks, you know. But I, I have other spots. You know, I'd love to get on these ridges and walk over. I mean, there's spots like this that you know I just know are good based on, um, you know, where where I am now. Um, but it seems like. These guys are protecting this area, th these petroglyphs, and I think they've been been doing it for a long time. And I don't, I don't know who they're protecting it from, but those are the vibes I get big time. I mean, they're just like, listen, we know you know, we're, we're, we're very proud of you, but um, go somewhere else and do this, because th those are the vibes I get. You can take it for what you will. I'm, I'm not really trying to convince anybody anymore. Uh, I just tell you how it is. That, you guys, that's my job, is not to be on groups talking about Bigfoot online, not to do anything else except to come out here and, and keep interacting and filming and taking pictures. That's what I do. Nothing else. I don't want to be on TV. I don't want to um, be on a radio show, any of that stuff. Um, I, I have been humoring a, t a TV show idea just, just so I can finance this. That's all. I just need not to stress out about the, the money part of this. If I can do that, everything else will fall together. Um, and that's all. Give me a sec. I'm heading in. Um, I just wanted you guys to, you know, just see how cool this is. And nobody, nobody comes like rock stack. Is that rock? I think that's a person uh, marking that. There's like a little dirt road there, and I'm almost sure someone did that. And that's not Bigfoot. Um, as you can see, there's just nothing. I, I literally have driven um, 70 miles to get here with not passing one car. There is nobody on the road out here. Uh, it's one of the reasons I love being here. I don't think it affects, I can see 100 cars, it won't affect what I'm going to do out there today, but I just like that nobody's around. I just love it, um, except when you break down, it's the best thing in the world. Alright, give me a second, I'm heading in, actually in there, you can see how much bigger it's getting now as I get close. 
through my dirty window. They gotta go back in there. They, they know right now, you know, miles before you get here, this is their job. They know, they're like, here he comes. You know, and I, I think Callie mentioned to me, he's like, some guy's like, you guys are doing it all wrong, you gotta sneak in there. Da -da -da. You guys are too loud. I mean, listen. You have no idea what you're talking about, okay? If they know you're coming, it doesn't matter. I could have crawled from New Jersey on my stomach and they would just laugh at me. They, they know you're coming, okay? It's all energy, you're connected to it, you just don't know it. There's no sneaking up. Be as loud as you want around Bigfoots. Go in there, talk, just be yourself. Don't don't be something you're not in there because they expect you to be yourself. Just, just be yourself. It's not gonna affect any interactions or anything. The quieter you are, the quieter they're gonna be. The more stealth you are, the more weird you are, the weirder they're gonna think you are. Just be yourself, make noises, whistle, talk to them. This is what they want, trust me. Ooh, that's a cool picture. We're done. This is so cool, I found this hidden. See, there's my big rock, right? When you're down at that corner and you look up, you can't tell this is walkable. It just looks like all like a big giant rock face. Now it may not amount to anything, but I thought it was pretty cool that I could get into a place that was right in my eye line for seven times I've been here. But yet I couldn't see. Another bone yet coming out of the cracks. That's the weird part, you know, I, they're, they're shoved back in spots like that. And I can tell, you know, that's stuff that's falling from up there, but somehow this bone, which does have no marrow, and has, I don't know if it has marks on it or not, but yeah, it's coming out of there. There's another one right there, little one. I see a lot of them. Look at that little poop, too. What is that, from a rat or something? It looks like mouse, mice. Oh, you can't see it. There you go. And it looks like that goes that way. Let me see if I can't turn the corner. I don't think I can. Maybe. Yeah. That's cool. I want to see just that little turn. I want to see what's going on up there. So that's cool. All right, give me a sec. It's looking a little bit strange here, too. Whoa. You know, they say there's so many rattlesnakes here, but, you know, you figured I'd see, like, an old skin in some, at some point. Look, this whole thing is being held up by that rock. I mean, if I move that too much, look at that. All I gotta do is, I'd have to kick that rock out, and I'd be dead. All that would come down, just that one rock. And I think that's how some of this stuff ends up falling. You know, it's just those things just teetering in the, you know, just hanging in the balance, waiting to fall. A second. I can't believe this secret place. Yes, it's a secret. Because there's my car. And you can't tell this is here. It, this looks like part of that wall. Much less than having this back here. So let's go take a look. I was just thinking, just saying before, like, you figure if this place as many rattlesnakes as the Indian shrew, as many as the locals tell me, like not here, but, okay. By the way, I've been following footprints all the way here. That's how I got here. Like just, just like disturbances in the ground. So I was saying that. Yeah, you figure I see like one shedded snake skin. You know, look at the size of that rock. This today's cool just for visual. Like, I mean, you gotta see. This is what I've been following, you guys. See that? Boom, boom. This is such a spot. Look at that. Hidden. You know, I'm looking at the top ridge. I never look directly to here. Look at this spot. This is this is a Sasquatch spot. Disturbed. You guys, I like this spot. This is amazing. I'm just there's I'm six feet over my head. I love that big long. Look how flat. You just draw Metallica right there across the you guys look at this. So if you know Bigfoot like I do, you know this is, they love this spot right here. It could never be seen by anybody. I'm just examining. It's clearly a small animal. I mean, I don't think that's from them. I don't see, 
you know, I love seeing like when that's like that, you know, or if it's like this, you know, if I see something like that, then I, I like it in the perch, but it doesn't have to be there. I just like to see an extra, an extra something. What a spot, that spot, look, when you come out of here, see, uh, just, just so you understand, this is, this is a, a ridge in between. And I found a secret way up the one, but the one problem with this is that I got to go all the way back. There's only one way out of here because all this goes straight down. But how cool is all this? Look at these spots. I'm telling you, something sits right in there. Something sits right underneath there. There seems to be a big opening. It's small on this side, but it looks like there's light, a lot of light coming. Look, perch. What is that? It's, it's a pile of sap. I was like, what is that? It's sap. This is amazing. I don't want to hear about the camera, you guys. You, you come up here and keep the camera centered than me. I dare you. It's impossible. You said. This is amazing. I want to do a couple shots downward. Just to show you where I am. Look how big that rock is. Because that rock is so big. It's crazy. I would have loved to see it fall. It probably broke from over here somewhere. Dude, that thing must have shook the ground for like a mile. Look, so I found this is not visible. You gotta remember, I'm down there. You look up, all you see is the edges of these rocks. And they blend in and just swear to you, it looks like it just, there is none of this. And then uh, look, I got, you guys, it's impossible to even find the way in here. I got, I got it just by accident. Okay. It wasn't help from them. Look at the walkways. Okay. There, <laughs> this is such a spot. They're walking right here. By the way, under that tree over there, I got the same holes. They're, they're doing something with the holes on these trees. What do you want to bet if I go up there? Right there. There's some kind of perch right behind this. What do you want back? There's gotta be something. Yeah, little spot. I told you. I knew it. Look, there's a seat right there. It's a rock seat right there. They'd love to be behind these. In fact, I'm gonna sit right here. Anybody home? I like to get some shots, you know, back in there because, not for Bigfoot, but just for whatever, like, you know, that's, this is a spot that no human's ever seen in, their, in the history of the world. You know, and who knows, like, maybe there's something sitting back there. Looks like stuff falling from above. Sorry today's not that exciting, but it is for me to find this hidden place. See, I'm, I'm, you're straight above them. It's just, you guys, this is all made. It looks like something in a park where people walk to. And I'm telling you, if you could see how I got up here, how hidden it is to get up. To, you can go up to the top, walking up the steep hills, but to get into this spot, it's not, ex it's not accessible from the top, except maybe that one opening. Maybe right there. For them it is, just ding ding. But for us, look, it goes all the way around. This is amazing. I'm not even expecting timestamps on this. I stood on the edge. They say, they say these guys throw you off the cliffs. Well, I believe they're protecting this place and they didn't throw me off the cliff, so. Remember, it's the winter time, guys. I'm doing the best I can here. I can't wait to get back to the forest. Ooh. I think I'm gonna to go to this forest uh, tomorrow, the next day. It's gonna be a long day to get up there, but, and there is some snow there and it is a little thinner. It's actually, can I see it from here? Yeah, I think it is right there. Somewhere over there, you'll see there's trees. And I finally found them. It's, finding the trees is one thing. It's hard enough, but finding a way to get to them is another. Look, perch right there, nice and clean. In the middle of all the mess, perfect. Trails. Ding, 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 ding. 
up top. Oh man, I know they don't want me up there. It's crazy. This keeps going this way. Here's the problem. There's no way down. I got to go back because it's, uh, you know, as soon as I get to there, it just goes straight down. See, the thing is, I know the ones that are down there haven't gone anywhere, and they're still watching me from there. That's how they work. They're, they didn't go anywhere. I just don't know where to zoom. I can't figure out a good place to zoom. I'm still here. He's going to throw me off. No more call on a Bigfoot. And which I'm totally willing to do just to show everybody <laughs> that these guys are real. Because if I die here, everyone will know. I don't care what they tell you. You guys, let's just set this now for the future, okay? I think I've said this once before. The day you hear Colorado Big Bigfoot is dead. I'm not talking about if I'm missing, it's probably because I'm with them. If, if, I'm, if I'm found dead somewhere, you, you know. Just trust me, okay? No, I don't go out like that. No one's taking me out by accident. I'm not going to make a mistake and fall... There's no way I die. Mark Abel does not die that way. You got to trust me, okay? Um, it, it, it's there's gonna, it's going to have something to do with whatever's in these in these forests, and don't let them tell you it was anything else, okay? Because I promise you, you can pull this video up, and that's not going to be the case. It's park rangers and the government lying to everybody. <laughs> oh, it was a horrible accident. He was trying to climb up. A, you know, they're going to come up with some bullshit story, just like they do. Every other time. Have you ever heard one story where the, where the government or the authority said, yes, they were, he was taken by something? <laughs> never. They'll never, ever tell you that and set up an, a, a national panic. You guys, look at the perches. They, they sit all over this hill. Look how nice right there. It's all grass. It's all flat. All over this hill. Those are the piles. That's what I'm going to zoom on. Stuff like that. Anything unusual looking. Wasn't that weird when I was trying to zoom up earlier? I was getting the blur, and then I walked over. I was like, that's nothing to do with Bigfoot. I mean, I didn't think it did, and then I walked over. Five minutes later, everything was fine. All right, let me get out, let me get out of this spot. I said, I can't really see him. Circling around my head. These are the first birds I've ever seen here. I did hear a crow at a distance today. Just a second. That's so cool. So mostly just exploring today. I didn't even go for like time stamps really. Look, there's that giant rock. It's over there. I was showing you like behind they have that little inside. And then I walked, I walked in front here and I walked back. And you come out. They're all over this mountain. On the on the outside. And you can see this is disturbed. I mean, this is not an animal. There's no footprints that I can see. Oh, there's something right there. Some kind of disturbance. Um, I got seats all around these two giant boulders. Little cutties, you know, balanced giant rocks. Uh, things like that. This is a great spot. And then you come out front, and here's your front perch. You know, and here they are. They're just like... Even not invisible. You, know, you just put, just get your head up. Don't move it a lot. And know, as you're walking through there, I could even do it as a person. When people could stare up here all they want, and they would never lock into my face unless I moved. Um, that's just how they do it. I mean, here I am. Ah! Ah! <laughs> I got another one. Another strange one. You'll see it too much here. You know where it's possible, but I. I don't, I'm not buying that one. Right now is their chance. Here I am. I'm not dying, you see? I make sure I give them every chance. They could just throw me off of here. Boom. I wouldn't even care. You wouldn't feel a thing. It would just suck on the way down for like a second. <laughs> I think they could even make me want to jump. Well, they can't do it to me anymore, but they could do it to most people. That's cool. I've seen a couple, a little bit of evidence of some old climbers here too. 
at some point someone's climbed in here, I think. Very little though. You know, there's no, I don't have any trash or anything. Ah, again. <laughs> like it's just like. We got footprints in that sand. Another rock standing up, right? A little weird. I think that's a rock standing up. And I got footprints all through there. You know, anywhere basically that you can see, like where footprints would show, they're, they're showing. I mean, so the rest of the place, it's almost impossible. What really gets me are these piles around here. All through here, I have these piles of gravel, right? And even in there, in that, in that little section, I had them. And then in the fields over there, I was in the, walking through the fields. And in the middle of the field, it's, a, it's like a crop circle. And in the middle is a pile of gravel. Go figure. This is how I came up. So there's this one little place. This isn't it. You can see it's just, look, perch. Perch, you gotta look really carefully. Look, something has, has disturbed there. I came in over there. And I may have to go back. I'm gonna see if I can jump down here, look. And what's tucked right in against? A perch. I think it's two. One, two. Every single one of them, you guys, it's it's strategic. It's like it's just put in a place where he can sit and never have to worry about moving, and no one's gonna walk by there. I'm seeing it after seven times, and I know what I'm looking for. Imagine just a regular person. You're not gonna see anything in here. You're never gonna know anything. I'm willing to bet. It may even be tough in here at night because I think these guys are trying to. I think they come in. If you were camping down there. I think they're all around you, but I don't know how much activity you're gonna, even if you're looking for it, you're gonna get here. It's a guess, but I think these guys are doing something different here. This isn't, they're not about, oh, look at the human. They see plenty. Look at this. You see these disturbances? Like, it looks like a, a bare footprint to me. You see that? Right there? I don't know if you can see it. It's right there. I definitely did not walk over there. Now, something is going all through here. There's trails everywhere. It's crazy. All right, let me see. If, I'm going to see if I can get down here. It'll save me a lot of time. Here's a spot that's really weird, too. It's it's so walked on. It's crazy. You got my sticks there. The gathered random pile of sticks. I've showed you this. This is I haven't been here in a while. This is when I first got here. I was showing you the... Uh, there's like a... See, look at the walking. There's like a, uh, yeah, here it is. God, have they been using it since? It, you guys, I think it's been being used since. Look, they haven't stopped using it. Look, something comes down here. Look, even if there's people here, which uh, it's not, okay, trust me. Oh, look at the insides in there. That has a giant inside in there. Right in there. Um, they, they would walk in like this. You can clearly tell. It actually looks like they come this way and go back this way. Look how packed down, you guys. This is even more blatant than last time. So I'm just still walking here. Like an OCD Bigfoot or something. OCD Sasquatch. Because he does the same thing. He, he just comes down and, and paces and leaves little piles of wood. Look on Phil. Alright, give me a minute. I'm just gonna walk over to these crystals and call it a day. But I just want the camera rolling because I always get these crazy timestamps in here. This is where like they become like part of the rocks. So I noticed last time, well, on the video, when I was picking up these rocks, first of all, there's that one. I never noticed it. Look. It's so unique. Because it's perfectly almost parallel balanced on these rocks, and there's a hole inside. You can tell. That's me. It's only me who's been here. Total hangout right in here, right? And then it goes right into the inside there. You can just see it. It's just been... 
change. There's a log. There's a God. We could just have a keg party here. I say we do it. Let's just get everyone in Colorado Bigfoot. That feels big enough. Let's just have a keg party. It doesn't have to be about Bigfoot. I think I need. I think I was saying that like six months ago. Like I need a beer. I need to drink one night to to remind myself how much I don't want to drink. Okay, so here. I thought on the video it looked different in that area right there. It's hard to see with your eyes. And maybe it doesn't by today. And I was saying, oh, I don't think I missed them. I know I didn't miss them, you guys. I am always looking. That's all I do. Especially in this type of situation is look at the ground. There's not one other rock anywhere like that around here. Except right here. And I, I left some on purpose. Here they are. And look how pretty that is. I took a couple too. And there was just this pile of rocks here. I can't find the best pile. It is MIA. Where oh, there's some more of that mud. It's weird, there's like a dent out of it. It's hard. What is that? It's it's different than that other mud up there. Look at that. I can't explain what's going on in some of these places. Bones. We got bones in there. All the bones seem to come out of these cracks. It's bizarre. There's some more of that mud up there. I don't know if you can see it. I'm in a very tight spot here. Hmm. It's really weird. I don't know what could make that there. There's no sap. And I find even those two rocks to be a little strange, to be honest with you. They were probably like this until I messed them up. You know, just a little pile of gathered rocks. Fake fireplace. The weirdest fireplace pile ever in history. That is the most bizarre pile of firewood I've ever seen. I just don't, I don't believe it. More of those rocks. There's an interesting one. I meant more of these piled up pebbles. I was laying right in the middle of it. Huh, that, that area is just, there's something going on <laughs> right here. You guys wanted Flintstones? Well, there it is, except that that goes through. Here's that jungle gem. I'd love to know what's digging here with no footprints whatsoever. I'd love to know. This looks like a footprint right there. A giant footprint, look. Right there. And then there's this, these, this probing going on. That's what it is, it's not digging, it's probing. It's bizarre. You guys, look very carefully at these. You know, it's just very weird. What do we got here and then down in front? Oh, that's our spot. Okay. Was that going there last time? This is that spot that has the initials up there that was senior skip day. It's such a perch for them. And that, that was 50 years ago they did that. I'll bet you 50 years ago they loved having people here. Now, with, you know, people, idiots like me with cameras, they don't want such a spot. Okay, I'm checking my, my skulls. I didn't do that, but they're still... Oh, you know what I did do? I did do one on this side. There was one laying on the ground. There's one hanging as you walk in. There's one on the ground right down there. And there was one, I thought, on this exit. Uh, I thought there was one, I think if you're walking in, you'll see it, and then I put that. I, this one was just laying right there on the ground, so I picked it up and put it right there. Last time I was here. It's still there. 
and this is that part this is that thing that goes under and there's those holes dug and there's that another weird pile of firewood that no one's ever used <laughs> big big pieces of firewood i don't think i think that's sometimes where they make mistakes so if they're trying to copy us like as simple as it might sound it to us they don't get it that we use certain pieces of wood that we're lazy we, we we're not going to get these giant pieces like that that you can't get i mean look around you'd have to really really scour the area and find one piece at a time um and drag them over i know they they made these piles i don't i've seen it uh, in my videos and other people's videos where they make fake piles of wood it's weird or that's what i call them but i mean they're real piles but um very strange give me a second I'm gonna go up there or not yet today. I'm really getting the feelings not to. I'm just checking out some other spots. I'm actually looking for this pile of rocks that were gathered and put on a boulder. I found this new spot in here that's really, really uh, looks like it's used. I mean, just by looking at the ground, it just looks really, really t torn up in there. You guys, the pictures that we've been getting have been unbelievable. I'll put a couple on this video. You know, it, it's here, it's easy to find the boulders they don't want you to find because they, they put trees all over them. Wow, I've never found this spot. I've been right by here. Careful, there's this little... I'm clear up. That just goes back. This is just looking a little bit weird to me with all these extra trees leaning with all these trails. Look. You see that? It's so blocking this trail. And yet, I mean, I'm in here, I mean, I wouldn't know why. You know what I mean? It's so obvious that this is the way that's twisted right there, the way this is blocking all the extra wood everywhere here. Like that was leaning on the boulder. So I'm kind of looking for that type of thing for now. And I really want to find those rocks so bad. I don't know why I should have. See this? Look, this is good here. This is part of their deal. You guys, look at the walking. Look at that. You see, can you see? Look, that's, these are steps. Ow. This is a spot right here. Look at it. It's all disturbed, coming right up through here. Is anybody home? Look at this cave. Oh, look at that one right there. What is on the end? That is, looks like a footprint. It's hard to tell, I'd have to go to the other side. Let's do that. I got scat right there. It's really dirty, actually. Yep, dirty poop. <laughs> Meaning it's got, it's just dirt, it's poop with dirt on it. <laughs> Look at this spot right here. Let me see if I can get up here. How is that footprint in there? In here? telling you there was a huge disturbance right there it's right there I can't I don't, can we see it I have to check the video you know to me this is all disturbed in there you see that
What's up, you guys? Oh my god, they're so here right now. I'm not going into the details. Spot. Whenever you're in a, a place like this, you guys, and it's all clean, and there's a little hidden area back here, especially with a tree over it, it's been, it's been taken care of, it's been maintained. I see it too much. And something's coming up here big, you guys. Look. Looks like big footprints that were standing sideways. There's one right there, and it's somewhere, and there's one right there. And it's a really awkward place to be. Look at this. How could I have not seen these little trails? These little hidden... Of course this is where they are when I'm standing over there going, that I can feel them, you guys. Well, this is where they're standing when places like this that you think you can see, you know that's there. And it's not. Look at that little hidden thing. Gotta check my screen. Give me a second. It's getting blurry. I have a problem focusing like that. I wonder if my lens is dirty. I just saw that little black thing on top of the boulder up there. Can you see that? And for some reason, it's blurring. I don't know why. I've never had a problem getting to something that clear. I've seen no movement out of that little black thing, but I've never seen it before either. It almost looks like a little head. Typically in this situation, I think it would have pulled back, so I'm going to say it's probably nothing. But let me, let me see if I can clean my lens. This is just for the real structure people. You guys, look at this. It took me, I'm just standing here trying to figure this out, but i got to show this to you, okay? I'm not going to point out the Sasquatch that are staring at me on top of the hill up there. Um, I'm not even kidding. Look. <laughs> I just got to do it with a whole conversation with them about they're killing you. I'm like, you guys are killing me. That's what I told them. You're killing me. Like I'm from, you know, like I'm a New Yorker. You're killing me. So look. All right, you got, see the break? It's such a blatant break. There's no way that that branch broke and nothing else around it, okay? Look at how everything here is twisted up. You see that twist? I've, I've realized that it's 100% not natural here. It had to be done. You just can't tell. That's the amazing part. Structure here. This is brought over. This is put up. It's a structure. Break. Really twisted. Look. Look at that. If you didn't believe me about the twist, you'll believe me now. Look at that one. You can't twist something by with the wind by accident like that. And then, not only is it twisted, it goes in here, which is pretty cool. I'm kind of a done explaining structures, but this is kind of neat. I mean, you really have to explain this because you can't tell. And it goes in here. It's all twisted up with this one. This thing has been... They've, they've loved this tree for a long time before it was dead. It's all twisted. It's crazy. This whole little hangout right here is amazing to me. And I got footprints back here. Um, I've shown them already, but I think they're still here. Oh, I stepped on a couple. They're, they're just... These are mine, but they're, they're really good. They're like this. They're like really deep and you can see the, 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 you know, the palm. Like if I took my shoes off right now, my, my feet would sink. You know, my, my shoes are actually keeping me up. That's old scat from something. I'm taking the, the most blatant way in, which is like this little ravine with sand in it. I can see my old footprints. And I'm really trying to locate a rock that I thought I knew where it was, and here's another one of those piles. I stepped in that. I'm almost sure that was from me. Yeah, because look, there's my footprints. I'll never fool you. It doesn't look like a footprint, but I did that. Here's the other side of that. This is a little, you know, wallow type of thing. You know, and it's right on the way up to their stuff. To, to the main area, which is up there. I got like, I, right now I have a block. They do not want me going up there.
So this is just kind of a, I, I'm not trying to blow your mind here with a video. I just wanted to kind of reinvestigate. I really thought I was gonna go up there, but if you had the feelings that I do about not going up there, <laughs> you probably wouldn't. I think there's some way in up there. Um, it's their main spot. I saw the, the faces in the cave. I know where I'm supposed to go. And I just get like the overwhelming, like, it's, it's almost like a polite, please don't come up. You know, this is our thing. You know, it's not like a violent or a mean thing. It's just almost like a please thing. I don't know, believe that or not. Bone. A lot of bones around here. I'm talking about a lot. I don't show you guys the half of them. Ooh, what's that? It looks like a footprint. It looks like it goes through there. That's the, that's the thing about these guys. You know, they, they they'll just go right through there. That's his walkway. You know where I oh, another bone. You know where I got to be in here. Look, this is all disturbed. I got scat. I, I really want to get some trail cams in here. I think maybe that's the next best bet. Just some, get some really good. I got to order some new ones. I'm still using my old ones. And I, I want to upgrade to some really good trail cams. I want to have some, I think it was Trail to Bigfoot, the, the ones that suggested that to me. Or to everybody, they said, uh, don't set your trail cam for, but this is why Bigfoots aren't on trail cams, you guys, because they know, and, they, and they're, they have this cloaking ability, okay? They're like predator, and they're gonna walk, they can walk by that camera a thousand times, You'll, it'll never set it off unless they want it to go off. And that's why you don't get anything on trail cams. Because they're not they're not that stupid, you guys. That's why they've been so successful for so long. But you, you never know. Um, I don't think there's ever been a trail cam put here. And my footprints. I'm the only one that's been around here. I've got footprints everywhere I go. Even if I think I'm in a new spot, I'm like, oh, I was here. You know, just, just to see some beautiful cat pictures or you know, who knows, maybe we'll get lucky and one isn't invisible, he doesn't know it's there, you know, who knows, you get lucky. These, these creatures are not perfect. I can promise you that. This is where I was following something. These dug in steps. Man, where are my rocks? I'm trying to find these crystals that were clearly gathered and they were just put like on a rock like this in a pile and now I can't find that rock. I left them thinking, well, oh, I know exactly where this is. Look, it's another spot right there. Can you guys see the spots? You see how maintained? It's like a landscaper comes in here and maintains this. You see how that one goes flat that way? It's like a wall. I see it on all the clear spots here. They, they love to take the branches and move it. You can tell it's been broken that way. Look, and they made a little fence. This is a little spot right there. There's no doubt in my mind. All right, you guys, I'm so sure about where those rocks are, like within, I don't know, a hundred yard or so circle, if that makes sense, just like, you know, this area. I know they were right in here. I, I just spent 40 minutes off camera walking back and forth, and I have determined, I found a few boulders, which I know, look at that, look how bent that is. That's how you know it's them, look at that. Look at that, that's how it's bent backwards. So I'm pretty sure, believe this or not, that whatever left those rocks got them again. They're not there anymore. Not even one left. And I can't be, I can't swear that, but I'm almost sure. Cause I spent at least a half an hour, 40 minutes, about the same amount of time last time. I think I even set up my video, I was walking back and forth. And you guys can see here, even when there's a wash, you know, there's nothing that looks like those rocks. Like, I mean, there's just nothing even cleaned up that looks anything like crystal or an arrowhead or anything. I mean, these are just rocks, you know? I don't know. So how they accumulated a whole entire different, you know, different piles of that, I'll never know. I thought it was like on this rock, you know, right in here. It was like right here. And that's why I kept looking. I think I knew right away it was gone. It was like, right on, like one of these. It was like just sitting there and now they're gone. And you know if they're gone, they did it, because no one's been here. I know no one's been here because of my, my footprints. 
And if they were here, there's no way they just happened to walk to that one spot in the million places you could go here. So what I'm trying to say is, besides that this is a blatant spot right here, look at this I just found. Um, that I think they took the rocks back or saw me touching them maybe. So as I come into here, disturbance, disturbance, everywhere you see there's disturbances, you know, and it's very unusual again, like as always, it's weird looking, you know, it's a, it's a little spot. Tell me that's not a spot. I mean, come on. This is how they do it here. They love it. Look at the branches. It's a perfectly healthy tree. You guys, these are impossible to break these things unless something breaks them. There's no way that the thing did that by itself. It's, there's no wind, you guys. It's so protected in here. There's plenty of wind up there some days because it's an open field for miles and miles that way, but it still doesn't get that windy here, you know? Boom. You know, it's, it's broken. Sticks there, structures there, spots. You know, they always have these little spots. You know, back here, little spot. You can see it right there. A little perch, nice and clean and soft.